Okay, hi you guys. As promised, I'm going to swatch um, all of the products I got in my large mystery box from Not Polished today. Um, so here we go. I have not swatched on film before, so if I'm not getting too good of a shot as we go, I will um, zoom in and detach. Go along. Okay, so the first one I'm swatching is Dream Seduction. I don't know if you guys can see the label. It's a pink two in one powder. Dream Seduction. Very pale pink, very pretty. Uh, the next one is Midnight Special. Really dark, burgundy color. It's really full, so I'm not going to tip it. That's beautiful. Very pretty. Wow, that is really pretty. It's a little bit similar to um, Wine and Dine, but darker. Wifey material. This is a nude I'm looking forward to using. I love all of their nudes. I have First Nude, Peaky Nude, of course, Nude Panther, and one other I can't remember. And now I have this one, thankfully. Gorgeous. It's already beautiful. Oh gosh. I want all of their nudes, so I'm really thankful. I got a nude in this collection. Sorry I didn't show the bead on the rose there. Oh, that's a, a really nice taupe color. Let me get a bigger. You know, I was looking for a taupe really bad on a for a client last week, and I mean I searched high and low and couldn't find this color. Oh, I'm really happy to have that. Look at that, you guys. That's beautiful. Really nice. All right, so those are the three out of all of these that I got that don't have a glitter or a shimmer. <clears throat> and we're going to go into Rose, which does have a shimmer. I did already open these. This is really pretty. I don't know about you guys, but I like to swatch or use when I'm doing nails any of the... You know, this has a slight shimmer to it, too, now that I'm looking at it. Um, I like to use the... Any glitters last, so I don't get it in my monomer. Alright. That has a nude um, look to it as well. Oh, that is beautiful. Really pretty. Again, guys, I'll zoom in a little bit better in a minute. And this is Lightning Strike. A yellow shimmery color. Not specifically, I would say, a glitter, but a shimmer. It's pretty glittery. It's quite neon on the brush. Let's see what about on here. Yeah, that is some POW. The glitter mix that's in it uh, looks like it has some orange and green. That is really, we're really good with some neon nails closer to summer or even maybe um, some 4th of July pop. Oh, I didn't open this one because it's sugar effect. It says it's a 2-in-1. It says it's a, um, you know, it's an acrylic, but it is very 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 glittery and I know this is really good to use when you're sugaring so it's called sugar effect I've seen in several videos that Tao and V have done where they use this so since I have it out I'll just do it but it is a pre-mixed acrylic so you can use it for sugaring or you, know, you, you won't get that much of a bead because uh, it's just so much glitter but that is gorgeous very snowy it's not sticking to my brush either very much. That's pretty nice. Um, 
Well, that's because I have my beautiful knot polish number 12. I don't know if you guys can see my Dappen dish in the frame or not, but I have this guy too. Love it. Um, okay, so that's Sugar Effect. Ice Castle. Also very Christmassy, silvery. This has definitely more... Um, acrylic in it. Wow. That is really silver. Silver. Beautiful. Okay, now I'm going to swatch my three, the three that I got from their OMG collection, their OMG glitter collection. So this is high maintenance. This looks like a gorgeous, I'm loving that nude. Still loving that nude. And this rose. Very pretty. Wow, look at this, guys. It's very chunky glitter in here. <laughs> look at that bead. <laughs> it's like one of those geode rocks or something. That's awesome. So I imagine if you're working with this, you have to make sure you, of course, clear cap it, but... Um, also, maybe lay it flat a little. That's beautiful. Wow. Look at that. Look at that. I'm already imagining what I can do with that. I've seen a lot of nails with this kind of, you know, used in a color blocking area. And oops, I didn't uh, look at the name of this before I opened it. Yeah, that's going to look going to be really cool for some color blocking. This is from the OMG collection as well, Aftershock. This is another really chunky glitter from that collection. Gorgeous. Um, and just like any of their other acrylics, the powder in there is super buttery. It just feels really nice. Look at that, you guys. Really, really nice. Wow. I use a little more monomer than normal because that made kind of a dry bead. Both of those made kind of a dry bead. I'm going to use a little more monomer to pick up uh, maybe a small. Let's see how this looks. Yeah. Work with it a little bit more wet. Then that makes sense because it's so chunky. Beautiful. And I saved the best for last. This was the one that I really was um, happy to get. Harry Twinkle, how adorable is that? Also from the OMG Glitter Collection. How cool is their packaging, you guys? It's just sexy. Sexy. All right, look at that. Can you die? Oh my gosh. Okay, so let's get a wet bead. Look at how dimensional that is. Like, what? Beautiful. Pretty. All right, guys, so there you go. I have two, four, six, eight. Really, two, four, six, eight, ten. Yeah, ten acrylics. All in different shapes and sizes. Let me uh, bring you guys closer on this. <laughs> 